Here we go. Come on. Oh! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> what up, y'all, and welcome back to another one. I am out here with Dustin and Jordan. Dustin is the one that we went to his big barn loft and traded out the pigeons. Yeah, that guy. And then we got the bearded Jordan himself. Someone thought we were brothers. Did you read that? Yeah, yeah really? someone, yeah, someone down in the comments are like, you guys gotta be cousins, brothers, something. But today we are on a little 410 dove hunt challenge. Y'all love the last one where me and Jordan got out with the 12 gauges with the full chokes and we sent it. And we just did a challenge to see who could down more dove in the whole evening, pretty much. Today we're gonna do the same thing, except with our 410 pumped Mossberg 500s. Are you ready for the old Mossberg 500 I, today? I'm excited about it. It's, I know. It's gonna be rough, but. It's gonna be tough, I, mean, I can guarantee you. Yeah, we'll, we'll see if I can show you up again. <laughs> Jordan's tactic last time, hunting them like pheasants, it was the way to do it. The birds have gotten more skittish every single day, it seems like, to the mojos, to the spinning wing decoys. They don't want to commit to it like they did the first day, opening day that is. But no Fred again today. I'm letting him chill. I just want to do solo hunts with him for a while. Let him get comfy. He's comfortable. I trust him. He's good to go. It's just the last time with four or five guns, man, he, I was juggling him more than I was shooting. So on these little challenge hunts, I figured, you know what, let's just let him stay at home. Teal opens this weekend. We're going to be getting after it with Fred. Where he, Fred will have a duck in his mouth in a few days. I can promise you. But real quick, check out that shadow grass camo hat. Bad boy, y'all have been loving them. These things are flying off the shelves. If you guys want to pick one up, I suggest you do it real quick because we are almost out. Oh, that's that's always nice. But here she is right here. Check her out, looking good. Man, she's only been on the channel a few times. Today we're gonna hope that we can down a few, maybe a handful. It would be epic if I actually limit it out, but we'll see here. Well, we are out here. I have no idea where to sit. Uh, this is a rolling field. It's got some nice heels to it. I hope the wind isn't completely blowing it out. I don't think it is, but check it out. Got a big old bush here, kind of sitting in a little bit. Then we got our mojo way over there. The wind is coming this way, so the birds ought to be coming up in here like this. I mean, let's just hope so. Oh no! Well, first one down. I don't think I got that on camera. And sure didn't. The camera just started right before I pulled the trigger. Check it out. First one. Bam, bam. We are on the board. First blood, baby. <laughs> first blood. We're going to try to take home the win today, baby. That happened real quick. Wow. I literally just sat down and was gabbing with y'all, and then here he came. Bam. That was awesome. If you guys enjoy... Oh, gosh. Two behind us. Oh boy, it's gonna get wild. It's gonna get wild. If you guys are enjoying this video with the old 410 pump, you got to smash the thumbs up button for your boy. Let's get this video over 2,000 likes, shall we? With your guys' help, we can do it. It helps the video so much. I appreciate it, guys. Well, just had one land out here. Let's see if we can go get him. There he is. Missed. Big swing, big miss, boys. Always pick up them empties, boys. Always pick them up. Hmm. Got a few coming out to play. It's been dry here. Haven't shot for, I don't know, every bit of 20 minutes, probably. Here we go. Get in here. Get in here. Get in here. I don't have to try it. He wasn't going to come any closer than that. You sucker. Boy, howdy. Look at this. That don't look good, does it? Wow. I don't know what it's gonna do. Guess, or, guess I better check the old radar here. Uh, the shooting hasn't really picked up or slowed down. It's been pretty slow. Seemed like right when I sat down and stabbed the mojo in the ground, two of them came right to it, but uh, seems like they're starting to fly a little bit. Here comes one. go come on get in here boy this wind makes it hard here he is 
go down. Oh, go down. That's a hard, hard shot with the old 410 in this wind, I'm telling you. Goodness. That would have been the old 12 gauge. That boy would have been all sorts of dead. We got a high flyer. Ah! That's 410, I'm telling you what. It is not the easiest thing uh, <laughs> to connect with much of anything. It's been a while since I have used the 410 and uh, Jordan was like, dude, we should do a 410 challenge today. And I'm like, are you sure in this much wind, you know? And he's like, nah, let's just do it. And I'm like, yeah, you know, you're right. It's just dove. One just landed out here. Oh, there he goes. Oh, I just pushed him towards Jordan. Oh, no. <laughs> he missed. <laughs> Jordan and I are tied right now, one and one. Yeah. We're neck and neck, huh? <laughs> well, been extra slow. This is how dove hunting has been. Ever since opening day, opening day was a complete banger. Goodness, here's a big group. Whoa, whoa. I'll bite my tongue from what my preview, what I just said. Two, ha <laughs> ha, we just down two, boys. Oh. I'm out. Well, that was a huge, oh God, here's one right here. I can't even get loaded up. This thing takes forever to load. Where are they at? There's one. Well, we dropped two right there, boys. That was pretty, pretty sweet. That was sweet, a big old volley. There was like 20 birds that came all at once from that direction. That was sweet. There's the first one. All right, they're coming to play. They're coming to play. I piled up another one right over here. Sorry for the wind again, guys. Yeah, buddy. Boom. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, that's a little guy. There we go. Three on the board. Well, at least they're starting to show up here. That was a big group that came. That was awesome. Keep coming. Darn it. That's what they do. They'll go out, they'll swing back across, and they'll stay 40 yards out. Oh, man, tell you what, they got to be pretty darn close with this here 410. And one thing about this is these are 11 16 ounce shot. Uh, what is that? 1135 feet per second. That is not near as fast as uh, what I'm used to, you know what I mean? I'm sitting here and I keep making every excuse on the planet. I know you guys are probably at home going, Bob, Bob, enough with the excuses. We know you can't shoot. <laughs> I want you to get a little closer. Ooh, they might. Oh, I, oh, well. <laughs> I was on safety the whole time. I got all bound up. They were a little out there though. Yeah. Definitely a little out there. That one wants to come back though. Yeah, he does. I haven't been much better. Let me tell you what, I've went through more shells than but you have more than one. I do have three down, which for the 410 is I mean, kind of a miracle. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Come on. Oh! oh! <laughs> I didn't think I was going to get on him. <laughs> Woo! Just absolutely Dude, he did a le hard left turn. Holy <laughs> smokes. I was, like, I was like, oh no, I'm going to miss him. I didn't miss you, you little rascal. Ooh, he got a nasty headshot on him. Yeah, he got a he got a deadly old headshot. He's a bloody guy. Look at that. Gee, many Christmas. That was slick. That makes me feel a little better about life. Well, that is uh that is four down. What one dove can do to your hand. I don't even know they had that much blood in their bodies. Yeah, he beelined it straight <laughs> down the gut. Just, I figured he'd sweep off to this side over the mojo. Maybe, I did too. Maybe I'd be able to have a cleanup shot on it, but no, nah, you just he smoked him and he went the opposite way. Kept coming. I'm like, okay. Oh, here we go. Two coming right at us. Here we go. I'll take the right one. Maybe not. Oh, we both missed. Gosh. Turn this way. Look, here's two more coming right here. The single right here. 
I only got one shot in, I think. Oh, did we both shoot at the same time? I didn't even know you shot. Yeah, we oh. both shot at the exact same time. <laughs> a little bit of storm action. We've been getting sprinkled on for a little bit here, and it feels delightful. There we go. Come on. Man, they stay. I mean, they just flank us every single time. They just sit there, and they stop at about what? Oh, right here, right here, right here. Oh, nice shot. You got hit, didn't you? Oh, that was you. I was high. Right here. Oh, I have no shot. Oh, yeah. Oh, we both got one down. Nice. I went through all three shells on that gig. We better go pick them up so we don't lose them bad boys. Well, that was nice. Both getting one down on the ground in a volley with the old 410s that don't reach out there more than 20 yards, you know? Heck yeah. If you guys have a Mossberg 500 pump 410, drop a comment down below. Let me know when you got it. How old were you when you got it? Do you like it? Do you not use it because it don't have a long reach on it? Let me know. Where did that sucker drop? It dropped right here, didn't it? There it is. I got him. And it's going to be banded. I can tell you right now. Banded dove coming up. Uh, just kidding. Man, this storm's getting after it. Yep, it is definitely raining now. It's getting it pretty good. And those drops are cold on your back. <laughs> that, that feels like spring rain. It does. It's cold. Yep. Ended up getting soaked. I look back to the south. We were just sitting out there and I'm like, Jordan, that there is a lot of rain that's coming. It's like, yeah, let's go ahead and start picking up. It wasn't three minutes later and it came rolling over the tree row and I'm like, oh no, it is absolutely pouring on us. We are soaked. Well, it is the next day. As you guys could tell, we got completely rained out. And I was like, let's just drop the video and I'll pick it up tomorrow. But yesterday I got my uh, bit of revenge on Jordan. He beat me in the first limit out challenge with the old 12 gauges. But yesterday I got him by one or maybe two. He either had three or four birds and I had five. So chalk it up, baby. But we are up here where the pigeon traps are. I figured what better way to close the video and an awesome little dove hunt than going up top, checking the pigeon traps and closing the video up there, right? You guys have been loving me mixing the hunting and the pigeon trapping. If you like that, Drop a comment down below and let me know. Be like, yes, Bobby, keep trapping and hunting at the same time in, in the same videos. You know what I mean? You got to let me know if you like it. Well, here we are. Been a couple days since I've checked it because it was the weekend and they were closed one other day. So we should have a bunch of stuff up here. Let's hope. Do we have anything? Uh-oh, we do. Not a bunch. Oh, look at that. Our first white wing ever caught. Oh, that's awesome. He's got white tips on his wings. Look at that. Well, that's a first. That's a big thumbs up, heck yeah. Let's go over here and see if we have anything in the new trap. It doesn't look like it. Let's check her out here. Nope. Sorry for the train, but uh, I baited the roof really, really heavy last time I set the traps. Now you can tell they cleaned all that bait up, and now the only food left is in the traps. So, we should start having some pretty decent luck now. That's what I found. You have to give them free food, so they'll keep coming back knowing there's free food, and then when they're used to that, you pull the free food, and you have the trap, you know what I'm saying? And then they're forced to only get the food in one spot. Know what I'm saying? Look at this group of pigeons. Just tons of them everywhere up here. That's a pretty one. Look, here comes another big group. Gee, many Christmas. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Whoa! Those went right over my head. <laughs> Heck yeah, two? That ain't bad. I really thought we would have trapped a lot more because it has been a couple days since we've been up here. So this is our pretty one here. Let's check him out. Yeah, he's 
pretty. He's, he's probably one of the prettiest ones I've ever trapped. He's an older bird. Check him out though. He's got white wingtips. Got a little bit of white on his head. He's an older bird and he looks really good. Yeah, he's definitely an older bird. He is big. He's a handful. There's one. Another one. Another really mature bird. Wow. These both of these birds are really, really mature. And a blue chick. Very, very mature birds. Good. But look at that. That's a good looking bird right there. That's awesome. Prettiest bird I've ever trapped. Well, we are here. We're at the big old loft. This is Jordan's barn loft. A lot of you have seen it. Maybe some of you haven't yet. Uh, I've showed it quite a bit. I'm going to let these guys go in here. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Go on. There he goes. Now for the pretty guy. Come on, pretty guy. He is. He's a pretty guy. Check him out. Got some white on his head. Good looking bird. Come on, bud. But here it is. This is the uh, this is the barn loft where we're keeping all of the pigeons we trap. Jordan actually caught them all like two days ago just to count them and band them. Oh no. No! I was supposed to put bands on them. I completely forgot. Oh, right there. Look, he told me. He said before you throw them in there, make sure you put a band on their leg. Because basically, we had uh, we started off with a hundred bands, and we are at number thirty-nine and forty. So that's what those two need to be. Those two need to be banded thirty-nine and forty. That's how we're keeping track of how many we have in here. It's Jordan's idea, epic idea, and I just messed it up. Well, I'm gonna have to recatch these guys. Get along that, recatch them, and uh, put a band on them. But I hope you guys are enjoying these videos. I hope you guys are enjoying the trapping and the hunting a little mixed up, you know what I mean? But if you do like this video, be sure to smash that thumbs up button for you, boy. And make sure you subscribe because we're coming at you with four to five and six videos every single week. And if you're interested, head on over to Ducks Waterfowl if you want to help support the channel. We have all kinds of new stuff over there. Hats, hoodies, shirts, a ton of new designs. I will link everything in the description below. But until next time, peace! Audio